And Maris Football has reported for camp for the 2010 season. Head coach Jim Parody. Coach, just talk about the general craziness that goes on over the course of these last couple of days with getting 100 guys in here and getting everything organized as you get ready to start another season. Well, there's so much that goes on from the physicals that have to, all the paperwork with the physicals that has to go on, and then the equipment handout, and then uh, all of those things, and then the kids reporting from all across the country now. Uh, it used to be most of our kids came from within three hours of the school, but now uh, we have kids coming from uh, 14 or 15 different states across the country. Some have to come in a day earlier. Uh, their parents, they have to have flights, and they have to arrange a, for transportation. So there's so many things that go on, but the kids really did a nice job with everything this year, with paperwork and uh, we get off to a good start. The first couple of days of camp are devoted to a lot of testing, a lot of work in the weight room on the field. How do you feel that those went? What kind of shape is this team in? Well, right now we're very pleased we're still having testing going on today, uh, but so far what we've looked at and what the kids have done in the weight room and on the field with our conditioning, our hundreds test, they've been excellent. This year we had the fewest kids fail the t uh, conditioning test, uh, and so that's a real positive sign for us at this point. We'll get a full report on our, on our uh, lifting results, and then we'll uh, declare a couple champions in some different categories from our strength coach, Coach Clancy, and that'll be done tonight. Uh, but right now everything is going very well. Coming off a seven-win season and your first season as a member of the Pioneer Football League last year, what has been the mood so far of everybody as they've come back for hopefully another successful season? Well, it's been very upbeat right now, and uh, I think our upperclassmen have been uh, tremendous ambassadors for our younger kids in that they've uh, shown them what the type of work ethic that we want to have and what type of attitude and uh, the young guys have jumped right in all our freshmen we have a big freshman class this year but they've jumped right in and uh, and uh, made a good contribution so far and so we're looking for real good things we know we have a tough road ahead of us real tough conference schedule and then out of conference with uh, two Patriot and a uh, NEC school we know we have a, uh, real big challenges coming up but um, we feel we're going to do okay. Thanks, Coach. All right. Thank you, Mike.